Oh my days, it is cold here in England. But welcome back. For those that don't know who I am, I'm Sean. We're at the home of premium motorsport fabrication and this is Gosling Racing. So as you've probably spotted by now, this is a BMW M4 GTS and it's a little bit of a special car. And this car was actually opted from factory without the half cage. So today I'm gonna to be installing one of our T45 half cages painted in this beautiful orange color. And we're also gonna install a PS Designs seat panel closeout kit. So this is the T45 half cage. The T45 means it's lighter. On this roll cage, we've got the standard curved gussets you'd expect. We've got the joiners um, to make it a two piece. And this cage was actually specifically opted with harness eye bosses, let's call them. Yeah, we'll call them bosses. This is like the original M4 GTS would have had. First job on this install, disconnect the battery and get these seats removed. So you can see inside here, there are some pretty obvious differences from a standard M4 to a GTS. Um, the first things that I noticed are these brackets on the chassis here. These would be used for mounting harnesses to. So a standard M4 doesn't have these, that makes this carpet different from an original as well. And back here, all the little nuggets that the seat used to clip onto are gone and it's been replaced with these brackets here, 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 and there's a completely different type of mounting foot just here that the roll cage is gonna go onto. So we've got the interior out now, the baseboards, the rear board, all of the boot carpets left and right and the base carpet. So that's out and now we can start thinking about putting the roll cage in. This is this point of the build where we're putting things back together rather than taking them apart. So before I install this roll cage, I just want to touch a little bit on how this chassis differs from a standard M4. Now our roll cage mounts to these rear points here and replaces that plate. The GTS roll cage would have mounted to these plates here which aren't included on normal M4. And the normal roll cage we make would mount around here, but it wouldn't have these boxes in. But we're gonna use these OEM boxes and mount the roll cage to this point at the back here. cage is in now, we put the rear section in through the boot first and then we put the hoop section in through the passenger side door well. Uh, we've got all the bolts in for all of it and we nip them up at the end. Stay tuned for part two where we install the seat panel kit and button everything up real nice. Mm -hmm. 